You fucking guys, you would not give up. You, you just wouldn't quit. A fucking six and three division leader came into our house and you were not going to let them walk out with our victory. I am so damn proud of you. Every single one of you guys. Defense, you played so tough the whole game. Offense, the defense played so tough the whole game. No one quit on either side. No one. Offense didn't give it away, and, and that's huge, too, in a game like that. The numbers, look, the numbers on off offense are ugly as shit, but we won, and that's all that matters. You guys played a gutsy game, man, a damn gutsy game. You could have folded at the end of the regulation. You could have folded in overtime, but you didn't. Jenkins, you know, I, I called you out when you played like shit, and I'm going to call you out when you play great. You played a great game today. A pick to help put us up in the fourth, and you almost sealed it with another one. You played hard all game. Andy Reid is a fat schwat, and I like to stick a, a piece of chalk in his ass and make him write, I will not eat Twinkies a thousand times on the blackboard, okay? He's the master of the game after the bye week? Not in our house. My mother-in-law, as you now know, went to mybookie.ag, put in the promo code, capital V-I-C, and bet the over 46. So she lost and is now 18 and six combined with my wife, all right? She left a message in my office that I just heard it before I came in. She said, hey, I'm happy for you winning, but you can tell them to go fuck each other into the next for scoring like a baseball game. Hey guys, look, she loves you, but a bet's a bet, okay? Today, the defense looked like the monsters of the Meadowlands, okay? The last two weeks, the defense looked like Marilyn Monroe on Ludes with an itchy bottom. Spags, you had them ready. You knew your shit. You had the right D for almost everything Casey did today. You were ready, my friend. Sullivan, your breath smells like dick. You couldn't coach a shit to come out of my ass and you make my balls ache because you call plays with the imagination of a bowl of milk. 12 points in 70 minutes. I know. I know. In the end, we did what we had to do. We played to win in the end, and we did. Okay, guys. Where do we go from here? We now are two and eight. The good news, we are in Cleveland. The bad news, fuck it. There is no bad news. We came to win and we won. We had nothing to play but for pride. New York, giant pride. I got nothing else to say. Go and enjoy this one, guys. You deserved it. Take tomorrow off. I'll see you guys bright and early Tuesday. Let's see if we can get something going now for the rest of the season. Men, I'm proud of you. I, I, can't, I can't say it enough. Overtime, we won.